Hi Scorpio, welcome on my YouTube channel, Beauty Master of Scorpio. Welcome for this reading, a love reading between you and your person, uh, sign uh, for mid-February through mid-March 2024 uh, reading. Keep in mind, Scorpio, this is a general reading, probably what not resonate for all of you, but if you do like my channel, please like, share and subscribe. I will be very thankful and grateful to support my channel. If you want to have a prayer reading with me, you'll find all the information on my description box below for a prayer reading. Uh, I do first your reading, uh, Scorpio, <clears throat> and then one on one, one by one, I will do uh, your uh, person uh, sign reading uh, from Aries on through uh, Scorpio. Uh, Gordon, you know what you're supposed or what you can do here now in the premiere. Um, Gordon, it's a, it's a gentleman, he helps me out on, um, on the uh, prim premiere chat and they, uh, he will tell you in which sign we are when I do them for your person's reading. Uh, I, don't will, I will not put any uh, timestamp after that. Um, if you want, you can put then the timestamp for, uh, for a person's uh, sign, for your person's uh, person, for example, I uh, don't know, um, Aries or uh, Leo, whatever. You know, you can do whatever you want here with me. Um, let's start, Scorpio. I do first now for your reading. Uh, my love team, please give me for my Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus of Scorpio for mid-February until the mid of March 2024. Trying. Uh, we have from the 20th of February, we will have uh, Pisces until the end of the 20th of March. Um, we have Pisces, so we, this will train us. Scorpio, support and inspiration. Um, and Libra on their knees. Something um, could be that you are, are a Libra or you have very significant planets in Libra, but something here that had to change. Something that had to bring in balance, had to bring balance to have this tra train. Try, try, try. We had a very significant um, solar eclipse in Libra um, in October, mid of October. That means something from October on had to change to now bring to this shrine, right? To this uh, har harmony. Let's see. Give me please uh, this uh, shrine for my Scorpio, my love team for mid until the mid of March. Fertility number three. Give me one more. Shadow. Three and 18, it's um, 21. 21, it's then we are in Pisces uh, season, uh, or nine, uh, 21 is something very significant for you. Could be also a degree, could be that you are a degree uh, in uh, Scorpio the 21st, the 21, pardon, um, or you are 21, uh, it's your birthday, could be 18, like I do, <laughs> if for who doesn't know. The three uh, could be also the ninth. Uh, spiritual, that could be degrees, that could be dates, uh, but for sure what I see here, uh, Scorpio, uh, you are not any more longer like a couple of months ago, for sure. Uh, with uh, fertility and shadow is something that you learned about you like no tomorrow. I, I don't say that lightly, like, but once again, like no tomorrow. Um, you remember, like I said, I don't know, let me know in the comment if between um, mid of September until the mid of October, um, Scorpio, you had very, very um, challenging uh, situation in your life. We talk about your life. Libra is also our, our 12th house about spirituality, but it's something here that you are not any more longer like before, Scorpio. Uh, you change big time and you can accept that, you accept. You accept also the new you, but you embrace 
and you are protecting also the new you because you went through a shadow work here. Now, I do want to do first uh, angel card. I got to put now three angel card, please, uh, for my Scorpio from the mid of February until the mid of March. Meditation brings answer. Give me more, my love team. Give me more, too. Two more. Success. And yes. Choose a new direction. Again, it's a, you choose to be still yourself, but long yourself, either in heart, in heart moments, Scorpio. Meditation brings answer. It could be that you meditate a lot, or you meditate, or you found a new way of meditate, meditation. Meditation could be also through dreams. Um, but the shadow side that you took or that you had, again, from mid of September through mid October and before our season in November last year, you had here a big transformation, Scorpio, a big transformation. Um, the answer is yes. You are a brand new person. If you are 18, if you are 100, I don't care. You are a brand new person, uh, Scorpio. Um, I don't think that we are gonna uh, recognize you like before. Now three Oracle card for my Scorpio, my love team. You deserve love underneath trust very soon and forgiving and learning. Fears here, Scorpio. Um, I give an example of my personal um, experience, of my personal journey. I'm, I'm um, um, a sibling, I'm um, a sister of, um, we are three, uh, sister and brother. My sister is uh, the oldest, I'm the middle one, and uh, I have a brother, the third one. Since I was young, uh, since, let's say, two, three years young, I, um, I, was, or I, I was all the time, most of the time, the black goat, if you say like that. And... Um, And since ever, since ever, and since I, I, I am adult, all the family, most of the family, but also my uh, sibling, they said all the time, um, you never will change. Because I was, I was very rebellious, rebel, I was very rebel. I was most of my sibling, but also my family in general, I was always very, I were going over, over, most of the time against the, the current. Like everybody made, you know, uh, the, the typical life. They get married, they get kids, uh, you know, buy, build a home. So, you, know, all, you know, everybody did the, the standard thing, not me. I was all, all the time the, the opposite from my sibling, for example, the rebel. Um, I want to be always different, or I, I was different than, my, for example, my sibling. And my parents have said most of the time, you never will change. And if today I change, because I know I change, but the way I wanted to change, to grow myself and to embrace my personality, um, my, my career on this world today, <clears throat> they see me change, but they cannot believe it. It's almost like, no, sir. But it's yes, it's very yes, sir. Yes, sir, yes, ma'am, yes. And feels here that people, stuff, situation, person around you, they see you different, Scorpio, but they have, they have very, very hard time to accept that you changed. Now, if it's a change how they want or they don't want, I don't care. It's you change because you want to change for yourself. Not to please no one, Scorpio. 
So we talk about here, yes, you change, but not to please people or person, but to please yourself. And again, from my personal experience, Scorpio, I can tell you, I changed because about my life, how I want to change to embrace, but also to make comfortable my life, and not to no one, but not to no one. So people, they see me changed. Probably also you see me change, Scorpio, since a couple of years, since I opened my uh, channel. And for who doesn't know, I have another channel, um, the Italian style tarot, back at it up. If you want to enjoy me also there, I do also there tarot, but this is for all sign. Um, but I know, I probably, I'm, I'm, for example, Gordon, right? Gordon knows me since, uh, we, he said, just uh, wrote me last time, we made our anniversary. He, uh, he watched me since three years. And uh, I probably, he knows, he, f he found, uh, right, Gordon? I don't know if you see me different than three years ago. And I made this change, but for myself. And I think the same here. So just, you know, to, to let you understand, Scorpio, what you're going through right now. The people see you uh, different. They see you different, but almost like they don't want to commit that you changed. Like, it, it's impossible that Scorpio can change. Yeah, because you went through hell. You went through hell. You had to die to, to uh, get birth again. Okay. And, and you want to forgive yourself and people's tough situation around you. And I'll sometimes say, okay, thank you. I, for example, me, I, I was uh, uh, the black goat for I don't know many years. But because I was a, a black goat, a black goat, today, for myself, I'm still a black, but then a good black goat, something like that. Like you accept either your, um, your negativity and you love your negativity. If you have, you feel yourself that you have, everybody does, uh, Scorpio, but we know that, okay. Because you choose to go to another direction or you choose, again, you know, um, against the current, something like that. You, I think the way you present me, like, you were always, you were always different than other people or other person. All right. Now I start with the reading. My love team, please give me for the, for my Scorpio, for uh, mid of February through the mid of March. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Swords for the focus. Give me the recent past. Hangman, I take that back. Give me the new future. The Wheel of Fortune. Give me the challenge. Eight of Wands. Uh, what you see coming, it's uh, the Herfant. Chariot, what it's, um, what there's a possible outcome. And death, wow. For the over energy and the Hermit on their knees. Okay. I very, and I have freaking chill, Scorpio. And I have a jacket and, uh, and the sweater, but you cannot see it. It's uh, still winter here in <laughs> Switzerland. Uh, um, very significant, Scorpio. Very significant. You choose either so freaking negative, you say, or people's tough situation think the freaking negative that you are, and label you, right? Label you. The way, the, the way that they want. You let me cry, uh, Scorpio. It's a very sensitive, this reading, because you're saying either people's tough situation that labeled me, uh, and they profit sometimes also about my intention of this purpose on this time of my life. I stand up and I go for my path because it's my path, it's my life. No one touch 
my life because I create, I die, I get birth again, and this now time around how I want. Black goat, white goat, pink goat, I don't fucking care. Um, very significant card here, Scorpio. And I, once again, because you felt here stuck, like in limbo, I think uh, yesterday we had also the, um, the hanging man, if I don't mistake. Um, I have two aces here on your focus on your present, so it's a brand new beginning, brand new clarity that you have. Because you change here, Scorpio, this is a big transformation. Like I said, you had to die to re-stand up. Wheel of Fortune, new future is um, the change will be here, will take place. Well, it doesn't matter what. The Eight of Wands, this is a challenge. Everything will happen very fast, Scorpio, so prepare yourself. The her uh, the Herfant, it's faith. It's because you have faith or because the mind change here changed at once again drastically, but feels here that someone here, it's starting to be committable. Someone want to commit, if it's not you Scorpio, could be also that you want to commit, or you're ready now than ever, because with the hermit here on the knees, and I had I saw the six of cups on the knees, um, this is now like committable now this is something with match the chariot uh, for the possible outcome this is positive movement uh, like uh, hold your horse scorpio uh, it's like straightforward ahead after 16 minutes and 50 seconds let's clarify give me death devil nine of cups Ten of Swords, wow. The lovers on the knees. We talk here about Code of End and Scorpio. A lot, huh? You had to free yourself to die. Or you die to free yourself. You had to go through something, Scorpio, that um, if I will tell you like that in words, it will be peanuts. You had to release your soul from something here more than important on your life. You know, when you detach <clears throat> a soul from another soul to understand if ever was yours, but also to know how much independent, call it independent, you were for an energy close to you, um, to understand if there was real love, if there real was your soulmate, if there was real, really yours, Scorpio. And, or was that only, only uh, for accommodation? Was that only for entertainment? Was this the purpose of your life? So you, you are, tell me, you're asking, you not tell me, you are, asking yourself your big um, question, Scorpio. And I think <clears throat> the soul that you disconnect from someone that you really, you had to really grab it and take away this soul from some other soul was the most difficult thing on your life that you ever done. You were forced to do it to understand if ever was really yours. Give me the Ace of Pentacles. Two of Cups, Chariot, Queen of Wands. Give me the Ace of Swords for the focus. Wow, I have to, I have to match. King of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, and the Two of Wands, and the Nine of Pentacles. You tell me, <clears throat> I'm open. I'm more than open, but totally different. You tell me, I don't know either if they will love me, the new Scorpio. 
I love myself. I love me and myself for sure. Will you show me? I'm so new. I don't know either if we will match. If I will match with this energy, you show me that. And you show me, and I see the match here because you have, you give me here the Queen of Wands and the King of Wands, so the match is here. But you're saying either we don't match, for sure I don't wait, but I will love you anyway. Because you're coming from a storyline, Scorpio, that you're saying either I don't have it into my life, either I cannot enjoy this fruit, I cannot um, yeah, enjoy this fruit, if you know what I mean, Scorpio, I will love them and I care about them anyway. Look how much you change, Scorpio. Either from the far, either from the far, if this is not close to me, physical, I will love you anyway. Because you detach independence, Scorpio, you detached yourself from something ego, you know, something ego, like I have to detach. I have to take me away from this energy to know what is that? Is this codependent? Is this love? Is this obsession? Is, is this toxic? What is it? And today you found out this is, is pure love. that it doesn't matter what, you will love them either from the far. And today is an acceptance here, Scorpio. You caring for this energy because you know it doesn't matter what. Either I cannot enjoy this fruit, I cannot enjoy this love, the love of my life, I will love you from the far anyway. Because you show me here somehow a singlehood with the Nine of Pentacles. So you show me somehow I don't know, you, you know that you show me that you are by yourself. But so much you change, so much you grow. With the Queen of Pentacles, show me, I, I change for the best, for the better. I don't have to love them and have them necessarily <clears throat> into my life. And you know, a time, very time, because I'm freaking scared to lose them. Now I can release and also love them from the force. You're accepting here something today, Scorpio. This is big. Give me the Wheel of Fortune, Page of Wands, New Future, Six of Cups, Emperor, Star underneath, wow. Something is changing here. Someone can um, feel you love also from the far. This will change your Scorpio. Someone here will take the responsibility. Someone here will make a step here. Like no tomorrow. You are not for sure. You are not. Um, you, don't left, you don't let them cold. I don't know who this energy. But feels here. This is a very big thing here. Uh, it's a soulmate. <clears throat> it's a soulmate here around you. Uh, someone that really has very very big motivation of um, being the same page with you Scorpio um, it's like a destiny here this is a, a turn point of destiny star on the knees give me the eight of wands for the for the challenge for my Scorpio king of pentacles king of swords and the lovers four of pentacles on the knees it's coming so fast, Scorpio. Listen to this. It's coming so fast because it's an eight of wands. That you're saying, I don't know. I really, I don't know how will be my rhythm. How I supposed to put my rhythm on this situation. That's why it's in the challenge position. Should I go fast? Should I go slow? Should I, should I be more practical? Should I go more with my mantle? If I can give you an advice, Scorpio, release, release, don't overthink too much. Either I don't have any cards of um, overthinking, but it feels so freaking fast. Because you're saying, and what if I lose again my control of power? 
What you learn here, Scorpio, it's not something for five minutes. What you learn here, it's, it's a life change. You, 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 you cannot release that in five minutes, Scorpio. So don't be preoccupied because I see you preoccupied like, if and if I will lose my power, my stability, my new me, if it's a new, it's you, it's label. This is label. This is you, new you, new you, new you. Because you, it feels almost it is too fast. How should I respond to this energy? Give me the hierophant for the, um, what Scorpio is not coming, not see coming. My love team, five of pentacles. Page of Pentacles and the Hermit. Seven of Swords on the knees. Hmm. You show me here. <clears throat> I feel it almost like you know this energy, Scorpio, because you present me the page of pentacles. So you show me almost how how an energy can transform, or as it could be also a situation, have to be a person necessary, Scorpio. How a situation person can change from something so immature to something so freaking stable. Because you show me from a kid, Seven of Swords, you're questioning here, uh, Scorpio. Seven of Swords, you're questioning. Because you're saying, from the page of Pentacles, how someone can change to be so mature? How, because with the Five of Pentacles, <clears throat> oh, you show me somehow that you went through already something similar, or with this energy, something similar somehow or remind you somehow someone from the past, like in an immaturity, because you say how a person, a situation or an energy can change so dramatic, or not dramatic, so dr dr radical, drastical? Give me the uh, chariot, okay. It's a, I understand this question, but you're questioning. Almost like, hmm, you know the smile, like, hmm. <laughs> Something like that. Echo. That's smiley. Like, how someone can turn in a very, or switch so drastically. Give me the chariot for the possible outcome. Seven of Wands. Seven of Swords again. And the Hermit, ag uh, no, pardon, the Hierophant again. And the Four of Swords. Because you show me all of the sudden, this is happening. All of the sudden, this is changing. All of the sudden, this mature, so drastical, so dra so dr so you know, so fast. <clears throat> so how should I sh how should I manage my horse? If we want to say the horse, how should I manage my horse? Should I <clears throat> still make it through? Should I? let them push it through? Should I still question? Should I, how I would have to re, uh, respond somehow? Because you're saying it was too, almost say you are, you know that you lose, but like you are not used to it anymore to re, re, interact with this type of energy. Like you say, I am not used to it anymore. So how I should, should I take charge? Something like that. <clears throat> I think that you preoccupy too much, Scorpio, but I think more as about how you have to interact. Because it feels here that changed the perspective of this energy, of this situation or person. <clears throat> Give me an advice for my Scorpio for this reading. What Scorpio need to know?
Yeah, a, a cycle it's complete. Walt, Hangman, and the Ace of Cups, and the Eight of Pentacles on your knees. You had to hold a minute, if not five or ten. You had to hold to refund, first of all, yourself, Scorpio, to put effort first for yourself, but also to let unfold a situation that was blocked, Scorpio. It was blocked. And now you have the potential because you hold, you close the cycle or cycle close and you were stuck there, had to happen to have this, this new beginning in love. Because you are totally new, Scorpio. You are not the same person as before. And yes, I tell you that very, very bright and shine. If you say like that. Oh, wow, what a reading. <clears throat> so far, you're reading, Scorpio. Big, 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 big reading for you. Uh, for as such of a reading like that for you, Scorpio, I can, um, first of all, cry, because I saw me also on this reading. I, I'm, I, I don't pick up myself so much on Scorpio's reading, because really I, I disconnect from, from you reading, Scorpio. But this time around, I saw also me like a little Scorpio, the little Scorpio, how in own time grew up. All right. Um, please let me know in the comments. Now, if you are in the premiere, uh, let me know. Go, gra go grab a couple of, cup of uh, tea, cup of coffee, cup of wine, wherever you are in the world. I forget my water. But I cannot post now because I want to go move ahead with your sign uh, person, Scorpio. All right, I will put, uh, I will start now, uh, Gordon, also for you, but you know already. Uh, fire sign, air sign, earth sign, and then by the end, water sign, and hopefully I don't forget Scorpio, like, um, I don't know, three, four months ago. Um, I, start, I start now with Aries. If you are dealing with an Aries Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, whatever, let's start. My love team, please give me for Aries and Scorpio. What, what Scorpio with Aries? What is Aries person with Scorpio? Need to know. Third house. Eyes is on the knees. Um, now, what I'm doing? The communication and the interaction. So, someone here wants to talk to you, Scorpio. If he's here, like, and something will happen in uh, Pisces season. Uh, patient and planning, they're waiting, they're suffering also, Scorpio. <clears throat> they're waiting. They're waiting, they, uh, they're planning something here before they communicate. It's a seventh, could be a very significant number for you or for them. Uh, keep an open mind. Yeah, they wanted to be more like also how the way they, they communicate with you, Scorpio. But also they know that you are more open mind than, uh, than before. Give me uh, four Aries. No, there are too many in the love team. Give me for my Aries, for Scorpio. Three of Pentacles, yeah, again three, six of Wands on their knees. They want to communicate, Scorpio. Aries, uh, Aries for you, with you, wants to communicate. They want to like, also planning like to, or they, it feels here that they love to be with you around. <clears throat> I don't know, to be honest with you, which I am, if, is romantic and it's you know i don't know if it's romantic could be that the intention are romantic or that was romantic and now they want to somehow collaborate with you again give me the three of pentacles i, I put one card from from each uh, uh dark scorpio uh devil and um uh, strength on the knees. I think that they had to, they're going through something to release or they have to release something here. That's why probably they, they're waiting, uh, Scorpio, with the Aries. 
or feels almost like workaholic. I don't know why picking up like that. Like they put too much effort on something and not so much on you. Or they did not find enough time for you. But the communication would take place. Could be also Yeah, that they put too much effort on something else, but not you. Give me one card. Give me, um, <clears throat> give me an advice for this person, for this energy. The Herfant. Yeah, they changed the sun on the knees. They changed uh, Scorpio. With the Aries, they changed. It's something like a new mindset that they have. And feels here all, almost like that they want to participate more well with you. <clears throat> they want to interact with you better. But they want to clear cleaning up something that's important for them also, just so you know. But um, I like the Aries one, really, I like it. Um, feels here that they almost they planning how to come forward to you, Scorpio. All right. Uh, now let's do uh, for Leo, Scorpio, if you're dealing with a Leo. Don't forget to hit uh, the like button, but please. Never forget, right? All right. I do now for Scorpio and Leo. My love team, please, please give me for Leo for my Scorpio. No, I take one. Mars. Could be they have Mars in Leo. Uh, 12 house on the knees or they are very firing or the way they are acting very firing could be also a little bit of jealousy um, Scorpio with a Leo one give me Mars for my Leo could be also that they are very impulsive somehow because they are firing. Three of cups, authority on the knees. Um, give me a or oracle romantic card. Forgiving and learning. <clears throat> yeah, they want a chemistry on the knees. They want uh, your um, uh, forgive. Because this energy showed me <clears throat> I, inter I uh, exaggerate too much. I exaggerate too much. Give me uh, one um, tarot card for this energy, for my Scorpio. Wow, the sun, it's Leo. Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, they want to make officializing here. They want to officialize or they want to have uh, forgiving from you. But it's a beautiful thing. I need to say that. Could be when Mars, I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know, it feels here the soonest Mars enter to an, this energy or to an energy sign. What we have now, Mars, we have now then in Aquarius just now, just he entered now. Could be from now on, could be also in Pisces, when Mars goes in Pisces. Then we, we cannot forget this reading it until the, end, uh, the mid of February, um, mid of uh, March. What they want to hear, they want to have your forgiveness, uh, Scorpio. That for sure. Um, they want to reconcile again. Give me the, the sun. My love team. Seven of one. They don't give up. They're thinking a lot about you. They don't give up. They want to, like, listening. You have to listening. Please, listen to me. Give me an advice for this uh, energy for my Scorpio. Queen of Cups. Yeah, they love you. Page of Pentacles. <clears throat> They miss also your friendship feels here, Scorpio, but they love you. They love you. They really love you. But they feel also they're caring. You're caring a lot. But they know that they, somehow they exaggerate. Somehow they exaggerate too much. Um, I don't know if you know your sinistry um, transit with your person. For example, if you have a person in, on your mind, I don't know if you know your sinistry, 
if you have your sinistry, that I can also tell you, uh, Scorpio, if you have your sinistry chart, check also this, this sign, that sign, right, from the sinistry, from the ascendant, or from the sun, you can do that also, just to let you know, that works also. If you have someone on your mind, just if you have someone into your mind. Uh, Sagittarius, if you're dealing with a Sagittarius. My love team, please give me Scorpion Sagittarius. What's Sagittarius? Mercury. Mind and speech conjunction. Okay. We have Mercury very soon in uh, Pisces. That could be also very significant, um, uh, guys. Uh, Scorpio. Something here like clear. Look, like, okay, I got it. And I think, yeah, Saturn and uh, that will be, I think, if I mistake, if I don't mistake, Sun, Saturn and Mercury will be conjunct. If I don't mistake, the end of February could be. I'm not sure, but f for sure in the P Pisces season. Give me, please, uh, one card. Mercury, speech and mind, mind conflicted, financial and material changes. Okay. It's a five. They're going through something right now. I think that the mind is right now somewhere else. Six of swords, yeah, they're releasing something. Could be a career, sun on their knees, could be a career, could be something like they don't want to be in or they're about to commit that they are releasing. Give me the six of uh, swords, seven of cups, nine of pentacles. With the time they're releasing, they will have a lot of options. They will have a lot of options. I don't think it's yet that good thing to interact about this energy because they are very like confused somehow, but they have option. Feels here when they have the conjunction, they will get the point and they will be more clear. Give me please an oracle card, a romantic oracle card. I forgot that before. Pay attention to the red flags. I think that this energy of forgiving and learning, I think that this energy goes through too much. Um, challenges right now. They have a problem right now, uh, Scorpio, in their life. Could be at work, it could be about the situation, they don't know yet where to go. Exactly, but feels here something with the conjunction. They will, they will simplify something. I don't know. I feel it's almost that they have to take care about something first. Give me an advice. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, they have to. They have to death underneath. They have to take care first of about something. They don't show me yet. Could be with this, the conjunction. They show me something like, I have to make something better to maintain this equal give and take. They don't show me 100% how, but they are in the, like, in the process. Uh, like work in progress, if you say like that, Scorpio. Where is the, that, here. You know, almost like work in, in progress, in progress. Okay. Now uh, for the air sign, Aquarius. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, Scorpio. Now, just now, we have the conjunction between Mars and Pluto. Just now. Yeah, this is, a, this is a big thing. After that, we will have Venus conjoined also Pluto. And then will be the Big Bang with Mars and Venus conjunction. I think it's on the 19th of February. Yeah. Aquarius, if you're dealing with an Aquarius, my love to please give me Aquarius and Scorpio. Libra, the beautiful mind and, and Venus. You remember what that I told you? You know, Venus is, go, uh, is ruled by Ven uh, Venus. Venus is ruled by Venus, yeah. Libra is ruled by Venus, or Venus is ruled by, Vi uh, by Libra. Um, you remember that the soonest um, 
Venus will touch Mars or will touch Pluto in Aquarius. So you're dealing with an Aquarius. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, uh, something here will change radical. Something here will change radical. Like, um, something to, will be balanced again because Venus is in the mix. Give me please Libra for this person, for Aquarius. Suffering in silence, awareness num number na one and nine. Okay, I think this energy uh, misses you. They are not doing that well. Right now probably also their life is going through challenges. This could be the one. They probably they know that you are the Mac, the effort and the thing. Once again, when Mars will enter to Aquarius or Venus, Venus, Mars, somehow when both the conjunction are in Aquarius, something here for sure will change Scorpio if you're dealing with an Aquarius. Give me uh, a tarot card for Aquarius. Two of Wands, yeah, they are they're starting to, to make a decision. Or they looking at you from the far. But they delayed something here. Two of Wands, Ace of Cups, yeah, this is a confirmation. They take their time to the reflect, to, to not understand the purpose. They understand now, or oh, they're ready. They're about to, again, I see Venus. Let me know. The hangman, this, uh, yeah, and the queen of pentacles. They took their time, but I feel that this time around, they, they had to reflect, or also you, Scorpio, was very, very significant, important to see all the perspective, to see probably also your point. The point, their point, probably you understand now their point because we cannot forget what we see, right? <clears throat> on uh, on you reading, Scorpio. Probably it was necessary a, pow a pause, a break was necessary, or because about a pause or a break, you are different than before. This energy is different, but they're coming in. They're coming in. Uh, Gemini, if you're dealing with uh, Gemini, Scorpio. My love team, please give me for Scorpio and Gemini. What's Gemini? First house and third house. Okay, let's see. Discontent, four, and temptation. Uh, oracle card, romantic oracle card. <clears throat> Somehow they they feeling boring. New love, honeymoon. I don't know. I it uh, feels here that they are choosing another way, another direction here, Scorpio. Star, Ace of Swords. Oh, okay, it could be also that they choose a new love over you and they don't like it. Or they choose someone else and they understand that you are their star. They, uh, a Gemini shows me I, sh I, I, I replaced Scorpio, but nobody can um, nobody can um, compare to Scorpio exactly something like that is coming give me the star three of wands and because they had probably they replaced you or they they took someone else uh, they delay everything queen of cups on their knees they love you Okay, they love you, but they delay everything. S since they had someone else, or they date someone else. Eight of Pentacles. They are willing here to to put effort. Five of Wands, but it will be hard. It will not be easy. Yeah, well, 
I understand. If you know that they replaced you, Scor uh, Scorpio, it's the typical thing, right? Uh, like, yeah, you know when you don't have it. You know the value when you don't have it, right? This is like a typical thing. All right, now I do Scorpio and Libra. All right, Scorpio and Libra. Please, my love team, dream me please for my Libra, for Scorpio, Aquarius, now I have Aquarius. Uh, could be in this uh, season or just now, is happening, Cancer on the knees. Could be that they have Aquarius, Cancer in their chart. But this is for Libra, okay. Or this shrining somehow. Aquarius on their chart because a Libra trines Aquarius. Give me please Aquarius. Uh, give me Libra, pardon. Recognition and reward number three, hope. They have a lot of respect for you, but they love also to have respect from you. Children. Also, if they have children, Scorpio, they, um, if they have children, their children, they love you too. Okay. I see three. Three children. Two of swords. But the, the queen of wands underneath, somehow they don't know how to come forward. Or the children, they have difficulty to respect you. And it's difficult also for them. It could be also chariot. Yeah, but doesn't matter what, Ace of Wands to come forward. If they respect you or not, they don't care. They will come forward. I don't think that they are little children. I think they are um, bigger, older. Page of Wands, yeah, expect um, King of Wands. I have, <laughs> I have the match. Expect uh, communication uh, from Libra. A very, very masculine, by the way, very masculine. Like, uh, they will take care. They will take care of you. Or they will take care of, I don't know if you have a fight with their children or it was a fight from the beginning on to have this situation between you and Libra. This is weird, it's something like, and a little bit of interference. Now, I don't know if they is a children or it's a group. Um, Taurus, now earth sign. If you are dealing with a Taurus Scorpio. My love team, please give me for Taurus. Saturno. It's in the mix. Okay. Pisces on their knees. Again, I see like it's a very something significant Saturn here somehow. Give me please um, for Taurus. Acceleration motion eight. No, pardon. Give me Oracle card. Chemistry. They starting to feeling feeling um, that something is starting to development for you Scorpio but it's weird because they show me Saturn so they feel very district serious somehow seven of swords yeah they don't show you they don't show you Scorpio that they uh, are very intrigued to you lovers yeah the Sun I think that they keep them for now from themselves. I don't think that you have history with them, uh, with Taurus, Scorpio, to be very honest with you. I think that it's like an admiring, a mirror, mirror. Someone that admires you. They like from the far, they like you. Yeah, double, it's obsession. My, my, they're trying to manifest in you. Mm. I don't know if you know this person um, with a Taurus uh, Scorpio. If you know this person and you know who I'm talking about, 
And if you don't want, just protect your energy because they try to manifest in you. Pretending that they don't care. This is what I don't like. Like, I, the Scorpio don't have to know that I want Scorpio, but underneath, they manifest in you, so they are contradicting. Why don't show? Why don't want to show you that they care or they want or they want to be with you? This is weird. So be, just be careful. We Taurus a little bit there. Um, Capricorn. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, my love team, please give me for my Cap uh, for Capricorn. Yes. Leo, 12th house, could be that they are, they have also something significant in Leo, but they are, yeah, they're changing here something, again Leo, power on the knees, they are about to change something, or they risk something here, two of ones, they are, they are about to do something, you have nothing to do with this situation. With this uh, decision, it's, you have nothing to do, but it's almost like they want to protect about this decision, and, and then they come to engage in you, engaging with you. Like they want, they have, they have to take care about something first, uh, Scorpio, before they can come to you. Give me the two of wands, nine of wands, yeah, you have nothing to do with that. It's something that I have the four of wands, once again, engagement. Um, that they have to do before they come to you, if you know what I mean. Give me uh, an advice. Empress, yeah. They want to protect you, Queen of Pentacles. Almost like, let me do that first and I will be right back. I don't know, almost like Peter Pan. <laughs> Or, um, I don't know, the superhero. Like, let me take care. I will be right back. And then when they're back, they're full in. Full. Okay, nice. Like it. Very romantic with Capricorn. Uh, Virgo. No, it's not with Virgo which is an um, earth sign, they um, sextile in you, or us. Uh, let's do for Virgo, my love team. I put that back, square. <laughs> okay, it's so a conflicting here, Aries. Could be that they have Aries in their chart somehow uh, with Virgo, or could be that Sometimes um, the harmony is very competitive. Like you want a red, they want a white. You want a cold, they want a hot. Something like that somehow is coming through. Um, like who is giving up with the Aries somehow? Who is giving up? Authority, yeah. <laughs> harmony. It's like who is giving up? Who is giving up? I don't know. I don't give up. Me either. So <laughs> something like that. No, the... Um, Angel card, something like that. Meditation brings uh, answer and forgiveness. No, why I put that? Why I put the angel card? It's okay. I've, I leave it. I leave. It. I don't know why I put it. But anyway, meditation brings answer. Yeah, probably I have to meditate. <laughs> I didn't have to say forgiveness underneath. Probably yeah, for for Virgo was important, and forgiveness. Probably this person through meditation they will take care to to not be so hard with themselves. Getting to know each other, wedding. Somehow this energy starts to know themselves different. Um, they are very much with the competitive. Probably they are not so impulsive as before because they take care more about themselves, or they're more spiritual somehow, Virgo, could be. Uh, give me one tarot card, the tower, yeah, something's happening, magician on the knees. Something will be like an enlightenment here for them, probably during um, a meditation. Three of swords, five of swords. 
Yeah, probably they were, they were too harsh. My game, you remember, like, I don't give up. If you have to come, feel here because they were, sometimes they were mad with themselves or mad with the situation. But you know, like, no, I, I have to give up. Like, they want to give up or they have to give up to come close to you. Um, because with the five of swords, it's like my game playing around. Give me an advice for my Virgo. Four of cups. Yeah, five of cups. If you are um, crying over spell milk, nothing is happening. Because feels here that they say because they feel almost that they expecting you that you going to Virgo and they saying I don't do anything. Somehow they are not forced. I don't want to say forced, but somehow they understand that you are hard to get. And you, because you don't give up. And it feels here that somehow time is passing by and for them it's hard to stay and make somehow like, I don't care. No, it's not true. They care. Otherwise, they will not present me this energy. If you know what I mean. Now, I don't do any more. I put now the angel card away. All right. I do now for Scorpio and Cancer. Uh, if you're dealing with Cancer, Scorpio. My love team, please give me for Cancer. Leo again. What we had in Leo? The full moon, this was in January. And the 11th house. I don't know, could be that they have an ascend ascendant also in the 11th house? Or, I don't know. I don't know, let's see, let's see. Give me for my cancer, for Scorpio. Trapped in fear. Number eight, they're going through something. Trust. They want that you trust them again. They're feeling very guilty about something. Could be a masculine, by the way. Don't have to be a man, of course. They're feeling guilty here. Like I exaggerate too much. Three of pentacles. Eight of wands. They know that to rebuild with you, um, Scorpio, if you're dealing with a cancer person, um, they have to they have to do a lot here. Three of Pentacles, four of Swords. They don't do anything yet, I see. I see here that they're taking a little bit of time almost to um, calm the water somehow, because now it feels that for them will be too much or for you will be too much. And the five of cups, yeah, they're feeling guilty about something, Scorpio. I don't know about what. Cancer feels guilty with you, for you, or about this situation. I don't know what they did, but they're feeling very guilty. And they know if they will come, if they will come towards you now, it will be no good. So they have to be calm right now somehow. All right, let's do now for uh, Pisces, Scorpio, if you're dealing with Pisces. Let's make some space. My love team, please give me for Pisces. If Scorpio deals with Pisces, Taurus, the sensual. <clears throat> and opposition, <laughs> this is opposite from you. Don't have to be that this energy is a Taurus. There could be that they have a Taurus in their chart, of course. Uh, but it's the position of you um, with the Pisces. <clears throat> Either it's a trine, but somehow this energy shows me in some, some cases you are very opposite from each other. Give me please um, an oracle card. Solitude, number nine, and success. Number nine. Could be, um, we have, um, Jupiter in uh, Taurus could be also with something with Jupiter. B 
because it brings me, brings me to uh, brings me to nine. Stay optimistic. Somehow this energy needs more time. Healing family issue. They went through healing or child healing, but they are more optimistic. Optimistic right now. Give me please a um, tarot card. Page of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. They are very shy somehow. Somehow they show me their energy very shy, but willing to learn. Or because about you, they learned something. That could be also. Give me the Page of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Yeah, they don't like to see themselves shy. They don't like it. And the Magician underneath. They're in manifesting mode somehow. Or they're healing uh, again something with the child, something with childhood. Or because they healed about the childhood, they are now more optimistic. It feels here that they spent a lot of time by themselves or with themselves. Give me an advice for Pisces. The strength and the Ace of Swords. Again, I have twice Ace of Swords. They are very mental, um, clear mm. right now, uh, or they are one well now, very clear on their mind. But um, the courage feels here almost, they need to have courage to come forward or to show or the process through this healing had uh, took to have a lot of courage, that could be also. But because about this healing, they are now more optimistic. It's weird, they don't show me if it's with you or not, Scorpio, they don't show me, but could be, if it's for you. But I don't know. Um, scorpion, Scorpion. Ah, oh, finally. I, I thought that probably I could uh, forget, but no. Scorpion, Scorpion. If you're dealing with another Scorpion. Uh, one minute and six. Um, one minute? Yeah, sure. One minute. One hour and six minutes. Now reading, as I told you, Scorpio, was, uh, will be a long reading and I, I hurry up. Scorpio and Scorpio. My love team, please give me for Scorpio and Scorpio. Give me the Scorpio person. Also Taurus. That could be a Taurus. That could be a Taurus. It's the opposite. Because it's, yeah, oh, they have strong stores on their chart, that could be also, but you know, because you're dealing with a Scorpio, it's the opposite. A uh, North Node, uh, could be that they have a North Node, I don't know, let's see. Let me see. Awareness, number one. Give me a romantic oracle card. Attraction, yeah, it's the opposite, attracts each other, right? Let go of control issue. Is that almost a power struggle somehow between you and them? But they have a lot of uh, fuego, a lot of fire for you, Scorpio, the Scorpio. Give me a Torah card, Hermes. Okay, they grew up, the sun on the knees. They mature. They mature. Uh, it, oh, it's not only fuego, it's not only fire. And the King of Swords. Now they're very clear about what they want. They're very clear. Very clear. Give me uh, an advice for Scorpio and Scorpio. For Scorpio. Ace of Pan. Yeah, they're coming. Three of Wands. They're delaying here somehow, or that it was that delaying here somehow, but they are coming forward. Or it could be also that they had a lot of excuse somehow, but they're coming forward. Scorpio, that's it. Uh, almost one hour and nine minutes. Thank you so much, Scorpio. Don't forget, please, the like button. I will really, really appreciate that. I come next week with my next reading. Take care, stay safe, and bye.